So you're going to get a creep like this. The key is to look for, this is the front, and when you're looking for it, this is the hinge here where it says do not cut. And then the key is to look for the packing tape that's not where the hinge is, goes around what is the lid. Probably just not the lid. Um, then there should be a dashed red line on the hinge, on the packing tape. You're going to run your knife blade through here, go around the front where the lip happens, go across the base to the point where you hit the packing tape, miss the packing tape, uh, not the packing tape, the duct tape, miss the duct tape, go past until you miss, get to the next piece of duct tape, miss the duct tape, cut across here, up the lip, and across and back through here. All of it should have been marked with a dashed red line with a sharpie should say cut. The next job is to lift the packing uh, duct tape. It'll have a label on the end of it. It may, it'll may, likely have blue tape holding it flat so it didn't get lifted in shipping purposes. You can lift that, zip it around and hold it there. Lift that. Lift it, flip it around and stick it on top of itself. That should get you into the crate like so, and the cop model will be in here. There will be some packing system in here that will require either lean lifted out. Um, if it's St. Tammany, there is a sheet across the entire thing with foam core pieces built to it that holds it down. You're gonna shove your finger into the a hole in the middle and you should be able to pull the whole thing out. Not the model, just the packing. Then you're going to, there should be two straps, nylon straps on the model. You're gonna lift the entire model out. That should be what holds it in. If it isn't and it feels like it resists, Check around the inside of the crate and there should be you may see things that are holding it down the same Tammany I believe that's all that holds it down the mold should lift clean out and then you can look at it and just see if it's in one piece and that's pretty much it for resealing I'm just gonna pull these down and restick them pull these down and restick them they should hopefully the blue tape survive better than this if not it needs a small piece of tape across the bottom of these because in uh, shipping purposes if this gets caught, it will pull, and the entire thing will open up. So you have to make sure that it doesn't get pulled. Um, if we're worried about water penetration or it's sitting in the rain for any particular time, if uh, FedEx is taking it, these need resealing with a piece of packing tape just around here. Don't go over these. Um, and again, the hinge at the back for the lid is usually marked with do not cut, so don't cut through those. That's it.